chill, Jay, 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 shut up for a second. Just shut up. Bro, you might not send your hard, bro. Like, please, just listen to yourselves for a second. I, 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 guys, 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 actually shut up on a big man thing. On a big man thing. If we're going to make this constructive yet, yeah, can we just stop shouting in with, with the name calling? Yeah. It's so pointless, bro. It's so that, pointless. That literally gets us nowhere, bro. Like, bro, discuss the point at hand, get it off your chest, but just stop with the name calling and saying, I'm a bigger guy, like, please. Doing that, mate. No, no, but you are as well, Jay. Uh, like, please. For my sanity. It, now, say your points, but respectfully. Try your best at least. The point is, try the best. I respect what you're doing right now. But I don't think you understand. There's nothing no. here. No, I, I, bro, listen. There's no, nothing oh, here to fix. There's nothing here to fix. They're shouting. You two just pull guns on each other, bro. Like, yeah, what do you mean? That's, that's funny. We pull guns about. on each other. There was two people who pulled out a gun on me. He pulled a gun out. You exactly. pulled a gun Don't out. Exactly. Don't forget that he pulled a gun out on me. They pull guns on each other. Spicy. Someone's getting banned from the block. Don't worry. The guns are away. It's It'll be your downfall, Jay. You definitely won't remember. You definitely won't forget. Got to blow Dean's house up still. What on Dean's house? Not for now, but I will. We'll see tomorrow. Jay, you guns. I don't think you understand. This is your end. This conversation okay. ain't going anywhere. Let's go on. That is it. Moses swear and be serious. He said, "Moses, you can, you can, you can fuck off." What just come back to? The fuck is this tune? I thought someone was playing that from their car. Fucking hockey. Oh, sh beef. Shit, it's barking off. Oh shit, it's getting messy. Cocaine cowboy vibes. I missed it all as well. Fucking sidemen cards. I'd tell you when I had it if I was there, though. They'd all shut up. Yo, where did you come from? <laughs> Alright, mate. Oh, no, yeah, I was just up there. Oh. Like an eye well, in the sky, you know? Yeah, good shit. How long were you up there for? Oh, I just doing the, the wild arguing that was going on, you know? How, How much of it? Uh, a decent amount, I feel. What's the beef? What's the beef? Mmm. I ain't, heard, I, 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 I ain't heard Moses turn around and say you can fuck off before in a while. It's been a long time since that. I think if never we're going to talk about this, we should get Jay down there as well. Never thought I would. Just we got some snakes in the grass. That's all I'm going to say. And if you want me to name them, I'll do it right now. Yeah, Jay, can you come block? <laughs> oh, I can troll that. What's, what's, what's happened here? What's happened here? Matt? Yeah, just come back. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I wonder. Moses is like the one person who might actually have backing from T for a lot of stuff. But will that change these days? <sighs> mm. I haven't heard that much of Moses. Nah, yeah, I haven't heard. I haven't heard uh, Moses. You can fuck off in a long time. I mean, that ain't me. That but comes out very rarely. I don't think that's ever come out. I'm gonna be honest. Maybe, I haven't maybe, heard maybe that yeah, in a while. It probably comes at I've the least more than anyone. I've never heard that Moses. A Moses shouldn't exist. That's the problem. I kind of like it. I ain't gonna lie. I don't, man. Maybe you should exist more. Hey. Yo, AP. Yo. Yo. You, you left off in a hurry, and uh, you missed my big reveal. Oh, sorry, mate. Went to go finish the uh, the track. The track. Yeah, we. Be yeah, Matt on. showed me uh, something you've been working on. So. Oh, the south side. Taking it a little bit. Yeah. We it's got all right, you a, know. We got it to a three-minute track, so. It's getting right, Well, you can show me in a bit. But uh, yeah, so I was basically, I come out of the yard, yeah? And I hear like Matt just shouting, going crazy. Angry Matt. I'm kind of confused what's going on. Why is Matt angry? So, you know, I climb out to the roof. I sneak across over, over back there. You know, I, I climb up over here and I'm just, I'm a little, little lying down over there, like a little spy. 
I'm Are hearing some. I'm, I'm hearing some big argument busting off. You heard all that? Oh no. What's this all about? Because whatever it's all about, released uh, Moses that we don't ever really get to see. He's unhappy that Pitar lost his job. I'm unhappy that you're still around. And also that apparently. But you're gonna well. pull out a gun at me again? No, I you went saying? <laughs> oh, no, yeah, exactly, that. and that's gonna be your downfall. Wait, so, so, let's let's right address away. these two points together then. So, firstly, he said, Moses, you're unhappy that Pitar lost his job. True or not? Yep. Well, it's unfortunate, but he wasn't good at it, so I did that, okay? No, I understand. You know that I, what I, I do is for the best of the gang always, and unfortunately, what Pitar. Pitar's brain would love to do what's best for the gang, but he doesn't do what's best for the gang. So I had to step in and start making some actions, okay? Because the mandem that me and you, only me and you, were left to try and deal with and, and keep surviving, yeah? We worked hard for that, and I ain't letting it happen all over again. So that's why it's happened. Whether you're happy or not about it, I ain't happy to do it, but sometimes you got to do hard shit, you know? That's a conversation for you and me, T. Okay, well, the second one, you ain't happy that, what, Jay's here? Or still here? Well, you know what? You know what? I actually didn't mind Jay until I saw what happened. What happened? Never in my life did I expect one of my own gang members to pull out a gun on me just for simply uh, not agreeing with him. Because that's what happened here. Well, run it for, he didn't run, run me through it. Run me through it, at least, or one of you at least. Or someone else who's a neutral ground. I'll tell you my side. I'll who's tell you neutral my here side. though? Hang on, can, Matt, can I hear from Matt? I'm neutral. Matt's definitely not neutral. All right, who was, was Winston here the whole time? I was here Winston the whole was here time. The I, I'm gonna be honest. I can I can vouch for Matt being a neutral ground there. Right, new, okay, let's let, from what I heard, Matt no, was pretty well, neutral and letting you talk about it. The, the reason. Uh, well, hold up, hold up, Matt. Hold up. Okay. I don't think Matt's neutral here. Well, yeah, who would you, who would you pick neutral Moses neutral. then? I would say Steve. Steve wasn't here for all of it. Steve was here for the important bits. Just, can I say my piece just for a second, Mosley? I feel yeah. like context is important I, though, all of it. I, I can understand why you don't think I'm mutual because I agree with T's decisions and I agree with no, Pitar that's being not removed. It. Yeah, and I was saying my points of why Pitar's being moved and I can understand why you don't think I'm neutral there. No, yeah, that's not Is he saying mutual or neutral? Name calling and pulling guns is the issue. That right there is why I don't think you're neutral. The whole pulling guns thing was a one-sided thing, but you make it sound like it was both. I false. was over there when the guns were pulled. Yeah, exactly. So, so don't you I think that you up. were not neutral then? You uh, clearly no, you've already made your mind up. No, no, I, I think Steve should be telling the, the story. It doesn't matter. Or you should just hear from me and Jay. <laughs> just I say mean, your Matt piece, Lee. Nah, just say your piece. It's fine. <laughs> what do you so, think, Steve? I mean, from what? Well, I, what I think I ain't getting fucking shit out of you. So I need to hear something. Well, ask me and I'll tell you. I said I'm literally willing to give you my piece. Well, you Jay, said Jay, 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 Jay's telling you that Jay's just saying that he pulled a gun on you. He's admitted to it and he's he's calm with saying it. So clearly, you can run me through the whole story if you want. It seems like he's fine. You telling the story. Just to get the TLDR of the guns from a neutral perspective, from what I seen, Jay didn't appreciate how Moses uh, Moses' tone and attitude towards Saint, and told him to stop. And he he kept saying what he was saying. So Jay pulled a gun, Saint pulled a gun, and Moses pulled a gun. That's the, from from my. Not correct, Moses, on your side, or. Uh. You want to add yeah, but it doesn't mean that he was in the right to do so. That is pretty yeah, much no, so, what okay, happened. Okay, so 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 what happens? What what were you saying to Jay? Uh, or saying sorry. You know what? I don't even remember the exact thing that I was saying. I remember. Basically. All right, well, shut up. I'm got... I'm speaking. No, don't say shut up. Let, let him say, let him say his thing. No, but that's the thing. That, that's the thing, T. Point that's proven. how this whole thing started. No, but you hey, didn't let him speak. Mouth. He let you speak. We having, he was quiet the whole time we you were speaking. So how about you shut up? Moses, shut up. I mean, I will give you the TLDR, but point proven. They're having a conversation regarding uh, Pitar. He said he didn't like that Pitar lost his job. We tried to explain to him why it happened. He wasn't happy because he felt we all ganged up on him, on Pitar, which is why he lost his job. Then decided to basically say that all of our points for him losing his job are invalid and then all of the points he gave us were valid and basically just just pe just playing one side just wouldn't let anyone talk didn't care what anyone had Moses to say said this. and then eventually just started getting rude um being aggressive towards saying i ain't gonna let that happen so yeah i probably i probably shouldn't have pulled the gun i mean i didn't shoot him i pulled the gun after telling him multiple times to shut up he wouldn't and then he sat here saying there's nothing left here um 
I'll, I'll be gone. And then I said, well, if there's nothing left here, then just fuck off. And even then it was all the, well, you can't tell me what to do. And it was like, it's not really telling you what to do, mate. It's a choice. If you don't want to be here and there's nothing here for you, you're more than welcome to leave. And then it was just a bit of back and forth. And then me and Matt just decided to leave anyway. Oof. I thought they should have some time apart because it wasn't going to go anywhere. Yeah, it was weird seeing you like mediate. I'm not going to lie. I'm proud of you, Matt. Thanks, You're good. Mosley. Yeah, uh, Moses, Jay was here yesterday, so I feel like he's kind of repeating things that I've said. So he, he is in the right in many ways. He's in the wrong pulling a gun. That, that, that don't run. Yeah, I don't know let, what let's, not, let's not get a repeat of that ever again. Yeah, yeah, no, <clears> I, I admit that. I know pulling a gun is wrong. Heat at the moment pissed me off. My bad. I shouldn't have pulled the gun. Sorry. Worst case, take yourself a wave situation. As Matt told you to. Um, but yeah, Moses, you... You want to hear my side? Go for it. I'll tell you my side. Jay, the amazing white knight, saints, one through savior. No, you can stop already. No, 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 no. no he was allowed already. to run his mouth about. No, 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 no. He was allowed no, to say you, things you, about you, me you that weren't true. You can say it. I'm gonna do the you same. You can say it without the sarcasm. You can just say it as it was. Okay. All right. Jay, <clears throat> you know what I'm gonna say. I'm not gonna say it. Uh, Jay didn't like the fact that I disrespected Saint while Saint was sitting there, making personal comments about me i'm there trying to figure out what happened she's making personal comments about me saying that i'm stupid because i don't know how to listen it's like talk to a brick wall yada 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 she tells me to shut up i tell i simply tell her you shut up and that's why jay pulls the gun jay couldn't handle the fact that i disrespected saint not him clearly he only cares about one person in his gang enough to warrant pulling out a gun he's not here to be part of a gang he's not here to be part of a team He's here to protect Saint because he thinks that Saint can't handle me. Wasn't I'm not I even a, that thing? big of a threat. Why are you talking? I'm speaking. I'm not even that big of a threat. If Saint runs around to me, telling me to shut up and starts making personal comments, and I simply say shut up back, and he gets offended by him, that's a him problem. If he wants to pull guns for that, I'm gonna pull my gun for that. And then we can see what that leads to. And I guess it leads to this. Jay's not innocent in this. All I wanted to do was find out what happened because I haven't been around and nobody tells me what happens. I get told the most ridiculous things. Like and what? I tell these guys that I don't... Dis what? What's the ridiculous things you heard? I heard that Petard told everyone why he felt disrespected and nobody took him serious. And well, I don't agree with that. Well, what do you know Petard the feels why? disrespected. Yeah, I, he, they told me. What? And I don't care what the reasons are. If he feels disrespected, what, 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 what he told? feels disrespected. Something about Oompa Loompas. And Jay Mack and uh, Pratar, I agree with that. It's very obvious that Jay Mack's Pratar all the time. He can you try and twist he, it any uh... way he wants. Shut up, Jay, I'm speaking. He can, he can twist it any way he wants. I agree with Pratar. It's very obvious that Jay mocks him the whole time. Then I get asked, why did Pratar never talk to, uh, talk to him about it? I simply say, well, maybe he knew that just like you're doing to me right now, if he tries to talk to you, you guys are going to gang up on him. Just like Stick you're doing guns. to me. That's no, all I guns. said. And then it turned personal. And then next thing you know, he pulls out his gun. Right, the issue you're facing here, Moses, is I don't agree with Patar. I know, that's why I said that's a, a conversation for you and me to have. I understand that I agree uh, with the fact that you might you might have your own reasons. And like, I want to get to the no, bottom. No, but you, you said about Jay mocking Patar, right? I told Patar to his face that if he can't take Jay bantering him at a meeting, then he's soft because he, in that position, he was a leader. And he has the right to say, Jay, fuck off out of the meeting. But instead, he lets it slide and then feels the type of way about it two weeks later. And that's why I don't run as a leader. He's too busy trying to be a friend and be nice, but then be hurt behind the scenes. And you can't be soft as a leader. You have to be able to put your foot down when you need to and then switch back off and be a friend again straight after. That's what Patar didn't have. That's, he was too busy just trying to make disagree. sure we were being a friend to everyone and being in his comfort zone. He was too busy trying to make sure you guys had fun, had a great time, was all happy. But that ain't the way forward. See, I don't care if you disagree. That's, 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 because I don't, I don't care if you disagree anymore, agreed. though. I don't no, care. But we, that's what I mean. This is why this is a conversation for us. I don't, I don't like, you. Yeah. he's told me things that you might not know about, right? Or that he has not told you. I either. gave him that's the chance to tell me these things. No, and understand. everything he tells me is fucking is stupid and outlandish. Like, it's embarrassing right. the things he comes out with. All right. Don't agree with it, but I'll respect it. Now, we're, not, we're not running a fucking play school. Turn into it's, one. We're supposed to be one of the biggest gangs in the city. And 
what the so-called 2IC was coming out with was like it was kindergarten. Like I said, that's a conversation for you and me to have. I'll have the combo over you, but don't expect to be a we nice one. You can address one. it right now if you want. I have no issue. I find that very hypocritical for you to say, considering the past that we, considering what you and I went through. That what? The whole BBMC parade thing. I thought the fit that you threw about that whole situation was ridic ridiculous. I thought you were throwing a fit. I thought you were acting childish. But you know what? I respected what you said there. And I took it to heart. And I feel like you owe that to Pratar as well. Did I do? If Pratar tells you that he might feel disrespected regardless of how it is or whether you think it's a good thing or not. The same can be made. For, the same argument can be made against you, except everyone respected it. Respected you for saying it. I so why what? not the same way Pratar? I had a fit about the BBMC parade. Yeah. I had a fit about it. In what way? You you said I was gonna end up like Dave Perry if I didn't act, if I didn't fix myself by being paraded around by the gang. Yep. See how ridiculous that sounds. No. That 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 sounds embarrassing. That you no, get but that's what I mean. That's how gang. you feel. That's how you feel about it, right? Me, Pitar, and some of the other boys thought you were overreacting. Thought that you had no reason to feel the way you did. Right. So I shouldn't feel the type of way about my own gang being ridiculed in front of the whole city, being paraded around like this cheap trophy. I shouldn't feel embarrassed about that. I shouldn't feel the type of way when it's my gang. I shouldn't feel the type of way. You thought I was an overreaction? No. What I'm saying is, is that when you felt disrespected by the actions that I did, I listened to you. I might not have agreed with you, but I listened to you. You so have I to. I'm you to literally do the leader. The yeah, of course, but I'm also giving you the respect of being my leader. I can easily do what Matt does. Sorry to try under the So what are you trying to say here, though, realistically? What, what, what I'm the trying to say is, is you're that you didn't give Pitar the same chances that you were given. I didn't give Pitar the same chances. You didn't give him the same chance. That's why I said I'd rather have this conversation just Bro, between you and me. The guy cost us 40 million by his own complacency. I've come back to a gang that is in disarray, has fallen five steps behind other gangs in the city. The gang that me and you try to make mandem on top every time is literally we are a bunch of bottoms right now. I and, agree. And he's at the top of that, so he's to blame. And I gave him the chances to not be to blame and to take out ability and actually go, you know what, I'm gonna fix up. Or give me reasons to why he did the things he did. But every reason was stupid. It didn't make, they make sense. I told him, look, bro, you're a great gang leader. Go back to being that and go back to the Batar that I know you are. Because the Batar you are now is a shell of a man he used to be. So clearly I put you in a position that you wasn't able to be in. You wasn't comfortable enough uh, to swim there. He just drowned in the leader role. He drowned there. And you got in completely engulfed by it. So I said, I'm gonna take it off you and you can go and be back, go back to being the batar that you are, just a gang member. I, I see. Sorry, it's a Moses. conversation for you, but. <clears throat> I know you feel like you need to protect him, brother, but I yeah, think Yeah, of course, this because is... nobody else did. Brother, that's not true. Listen to me. You know I'm always genuine, and what I say has no back. It's I have no, oh, no hidden agenda, right? This is a relief. Yeah, it's pretty important. Important up the one, I don't <laughs> think you realize how bad he's felt. He's come clean to me and said things that this is actually a relief for him. I That's think it's why fair I to say no one yeah. stood up for him either because yeah, it's a not. lot of people. A lot of people made it clear what he done for the gang and what he was good at, but were honest saying the things he struggled with and yeah for me for example when i when t asked me if i thought he was a good e good leader i said the only thing he can't do is put his foot down when needed yeah which patar himself admits and um, moses you know me and patar i wouldn't be here if it wasn't for patar right he, he's the very reason he took me under his wings brother he gave me a home right and Thank then me. To, to meet everybody else like i love the guy but this is the right decision not only for the mandem but also for himself I can't believe what I'm hearing. I actually can't. Yeah, you need to let go of your guard, brother. We all want what's best here. But uh... <laughs> there's, there's no, no nobody has done more for the mandem in recent times than Patar, and you know this is true. Voice, I appreciate what you're saying, but I also don't think you understand. Patar was a great leader. 
I don't want to argue, but I don't want to have a back and forth here. But this That's is fine. You can keep that vision in your eyes that he was a great leader to you. That's fine. If you want to keep that image in your head, that's not fine. Not just to me. Like I said, I don't want to have a back and forth about this. I'm not giving you back and forth. I'm just saying you're, you're fine to keep that opinion. Like, I'm not going to press you for it. It's your opinion, isn't it? Like, I quiz everyone in the gang many times if he was a great leader, if they appreciated him, what they thought he was good at. I got a good sense from everyone before I did anything, before I acted on it. It's not like some Somebody impulsive here. choice. I thought about it for a good time. All I need to do from you, all you need to do, sorry, for me, is for you just to respect the choice and move on together with everyone do. else. I always do. But just move on with everyone else. And the whole thing from yesterday was we work as a team, we fall together. If someone ain't stepping up, you step up, you make them step up with you. And if you feel like someone's being complacent and not moving forward at times, you tell me. And I warned everyone that if people don't step up and people don't start looking at themselves in the mirror and actually thinking about what it is they want to achieve in this gang and how to help this gang get back to where it should be, then I will take chains away and I have no issue with doing so. And I said about there's an open invitation for the two IC, three IC spots or any kind of high command roles. It's a chance for everyone to try and step up and prove themselves if they want to be in those roles. You, don't have to try, you can step up and not be one of those roles, that's fine also. But if no one steps up to those roles, then I also have no issue just getting someone else from the city. You know, there's plenty of great people out there who are more than hungry. Amen. And in the same breath, you don't know if Matt hasn't told you. Uh, we spoke to Dean last night, and I also read that loose end also. Fuck Dean. Good. <clears throat> but also fuck because, because, because Batar gave Batar lets him let uh, Dean keep his vest even though he kicked him out of the gang apparently so I got yeah, I heard that about I it. got that vest off I gotta talk to you about what they said as well who's they you're not gonna be happy about it who's they who's they uh Batar and Dean mainly what Batar said which is what uh, I'd rather tell you in private is it a secret or is it... No, it's not a secret. Then why it's can't just... you say it here? I don't really want to have like some you all got secret convo me. away from... See, you will cry. Here. I don't want to make you cry in front of the whole gang. I ain't going to cry. You don't know who I am anymore, I don't think. Of course I know who you are. Nah, I ain't the same you think I was. See, you're forgetting. I've seen you become... I've seen you... Be... Yeah, no, I I'm was telling you, you were know for what I, I ain't this. the same guy anymore. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I've seen you change. Trust me, I have. If you think saying the Patarantina is going to say is going to bother me, then you don't know who I am anymore. It will, it will tug at your heartstrings. Say it. <laughs> you want to see your own gang leader cry? Is that what you want me to do? He ain't going to cry. I will be surprised. <sighs> you asked for it. You're going to last. Gonna hit. It's gonna hit hard, man. Just like I would hit hard. It's, I feel like he said it up. Me hard, man. I lost my mind. I was thinking of jumping of a higher roof after I heard this, but if apparently. He's stupid. If you come out with some dumb shit, by the way, I'm gonna actually be annoyed. No, it's not dumb. God damn it, it's emotional. Because the way you're building this up means it's gonna be like a, a classic Moses fucking dumb shit. No, it's not. Give me some goddamn. Give me some credit. Turns out they never cared for each other. That's it. You mean that's it? These are our days, what, day ones. They never cared for each other, it's and Dean. They never cared for each other. In what so way? Fuck them both. Wait, didn't you just sit here defend Patar and you're now you're saying fuck Patar? Yeah, of course. Because I don't agree what happened to him. But also fuck, fuck him too. Are you all right? Are you okay? It's not like you're the one in denial or something like. Have you lost your head? Uh, no. Oh, I have not If you want to go let off some steam, you should go do something, let off some steam, because I feel like you're just lost your mind. I feel like you've, you've, I feel like you've, I feel like you've come back and you've heard some like crazy news and you're just in denial of everything you've heard. I'm not in denial. I, I know so you, you I'm not in denial. You sat there and spacked Patar for ages to so then tell me fuck Patar. 
Yes, of course. Because it's not about... If it was anyone else, I would have said the same thing. It's not about who it happened to. It's about the principle. If that happened to anyone else, I would have said the exact same thing. Regardless of how, of how I feel about it. Because I feel like it's a slippery slope that we're going down. Moses, I'm, I, I'm not going to be hypocritical here. I, I confronted T with when he come on smoke. By right, I don't, I don't say you didn't have the right to be on smoke. But I questioned him, well, you haven't been here. Moses, where have you been then, brother? I spoke to you not like very long ago and you said some words to me that was heartbreaking and now i hear this like you care all much huh hmm. where was this energy a little while ago when we truly needed you, you this whole thing that you built it, it you we all me. we all we all know brother we always need you but we need That's you when you're in, you're in your right in mindset the... <laughs> not coming here to complain just to complain especially <laughs> when you're having to put in the work to to not help us be in a better spot than we are at you're you also at me? fault. You're doing so great. You were doing so great until that final part. I'm always Anyways. honest, brother. Anyway, anyway hang on. Again, Sam must speak. She's had her hand up there. Go on. Um, can I just say something? Uh, okay. So, like, um, I know, like, we're probably over the whole, like, argument thing about what happened. But the reason why um, I told you that you were stupid and to shut the fuck up because you told me to shut the fuck after I was trying to ask you a question and you kept talking over me louder and louder and louder because I have a problem with the fact that I feel like I'm never heard in this game so you kept talking over me louder and louder and louder and then I got mad and told you to shut the fuck up and then you told me to shut the fuck up afterwards so I would appreciate it if I try to sit there and ask you a question that like you could at least let me speak my piece because then I'm just gonna get I'm just gonna get feral if I if I don't so can, can can you please at least understand where my frustration came from? You want me to address what you just said? I think you're better off just agreeing with what she said, to be honest. Uh, but I don't. That's the most... Okay, but this is the no, issue, though. You, so what part do you um, not agree Everything. with? Everything. I was having a conversation with Jay, right? And then you start asking me questions. And then you feel like I disrespected yeah, you, you because you just bumped in? Me louder and louder. Yeah, but I am not talking to you at that moment. I don't care what you have to say to me. I was talking to Jay. You know what, I spoke honestly, to you. I'm, then I spoke I'm, to Jay. Wait your turn. You. Simple as. I don't care if you don't feel like you're listened to. I feel the exact same way. We all do. You're not unique in that. No, I don't. You started getting, you started getting personal with me. I never get personal. You started making personal comments to me. So why would I give you the why would I give you the light of day at that point? I why would I even entertain your questions? After you, you continue. No, I did it. I don't get personal. Everyone, everyone here knows me well enough. To know I don't get personal in these situations. Okay, Moses. Okay, Moses. Okay. You've only made things worse. Okay. <laughs> okay. Moses, what was, right. quote, what was the quote you said to uh, Moses? Actually, Matt. What was the quote you said to Dean before you uh, let loose? Do you remember? Oh. It's a listening issue. Hmm. It's a listening issue. Yeah. Moses, me. Moses, be very careful to not be on your Dean ship. I think there's a big issue that Dean had. I think Patar has it at times. And you're in that category. People who will talk but not listen. You know, people, if people reply to you, they'll speak their truths back to you. But you're in your tunnel vision mode so all you care about is getting your point across and you don't let anyone else speak back to you and you won't let anyone say how they feel we've had certain gang members that have been and gone that had the same issue too so just know it's a very clear running trend between these uh people who are either not in the gang anymore or they've had things taken away from them because they had the same issue something you can work on you know someone speaks let them talk. They haven't got to agree with what they say. Just let them talk. Let them say their truth. They feel respected. They get to say their truth. And you can say how you feel. You haven't got to leave and agree on the same. You haven't got to agree on the same stuff. You can disagree the whole time. You say your truth. They say theirs. Simple as. Move on. Notice. I agree with that. I, th I also... I, I think you felt like you were gang being ganged up on. And that's why you got in defensive mode as well. To your defense, brother. Wrong. <laughs> I also don't think it helped that we all gathered around like a crowd. Um, but to say that, I also feel like if we didn't, 
There might have been shots fired. Yeah, yeah, definitely. So as much as I don't think we should have crowded around like some school kids, I think uh, in that situation, it just so happened to pay off. I don't think anyone was trying to gang up on you either. We were just trying to inform you with the facts we've learned for the past few days that you maybe didn't know about. You know? If it came across as ganging up, that wasn't their intentions. It was just how it happened. Yeah, and I don't think it was. I don't think anyone expected it to turn into what it did. You know? No. I, I did. I, you think? <laughs> yes. It's, well, a it's, been it's, a for, it, it, it's been brewing for a while between them. True. I think it's something that definitely needs to get worked on between you two as well. I, I, there's definitely you tension you there. Two, are you talking about me and Moses? Yeah, because yeah, I, I, I feel yeah. like... I feel like you can have your differences, right? And whether or not, you know, you, you have that level of respect, you're both part of the same gang, right? Um, so I think we need to at least make sure that everyone's like keeping it chill between each other, you know? So you can either come to mutual terms or, you know, secretly hate each other, but still work with each other. Uh, either or yeah, we need to make sure may. that we're strong. I'm not saying that's you why are. You a gun I'm, on just, me, right? I'm just saying. Yeah, let's not forget that part. He'll not do that. I apologize at the same both, time. You two can't I'm believe already, for I'm it. I already said sorry. I did pull a gun on you. It doesn't mean I hate you. Hate's a strong word. Trust me. You got to do something real fucked up for me to hate you. That's the thing. I've, I would never do that for. I would never do that to you, Jay. I don't know if I can say the same about you. Okay, that's not a problem. Most well, at the same time, you also know that I've done the same thing a couple of times. So we all done it. Somewhat. Pulled a gun out on someone. You shouldn't have pulled a gun out on. You never done it with me because I never gave you a reason, did I? <laughs> 